So uh, AI today, I would say, doesn't have true creativity in the sense that it can't come up with a new conjecture yet or a new hypothesis. It can maybe prove something uh, that you give it, uh, but it's not able to come up with a sort of new idea or new theory itself. So uh, I think that would be one of the tests actually what, for what AGI. Is, what is that creativity as a human? Yeah. What is creativity? Well, then? I think it's this sort of intuitive leaps that we often celebrate with the best scientists in history and, and, and artists, of course. Um, and you know, maybe it's done through analogy or analogical reasoning. There are many theories in psychology and neuroscience and as to how uh, we as human scientists do it. But a good test for it would be something like um, give uh, one of these modern AI systems a knowledge cutoff of 1901 one and see if it can come up with special relativity like Einstein did in 1905, right? If it's able to do that, then I think uh, we're onto something really, uh, really important. We're perhaps we're nearing an AGI. Another example would be with our uh, AlphaGo program that beat the world champion at Go. Um, not only did it win in you know, about 10 years ago, it, it invented new strategies that had never been seen before uh, for the game of Go. This is famously Move 37 in game two that is now studied. But can an AI system come up with a game as elegant, as satisfying, as aesthetically beautiful as Go? Not just a new strategy. And the answer to those things at the moment is no. So that's one of the things I think that's missing uh, from uh, a true general system and AGI system is it should be able to do uh, those kinds of things as well.